I'm gonna hit the switch from a pass. I'm gonna show you a gi and no gi version. This school here, Fitness Fight Factories, B Quick Jiu Jitsu headquarters, got a lot of MMA fighters out of it. The head coach is Johnny Bedford, the man holding the camera. It's a D1 wrestler, it's influenced my game, but also just the switch. I love the switch. It comes from wrestling more than Jiu Jitsu, but it leads to the back. So it's a Jiu Jitsu black belt, the back is king. I'm trying to get to the back, okay? So let's show this from a couple angles. Now, I may be coming through a cut through pass here, and I have his collar, okay? He's got his underhook. So like, if I have his sleeve, I'll show you the sleeve. And, I, and I'm trying to do this classic pass from trying to pass, right? So if I have his sleeve, I can shelf it so I don't have to fight the seesaw battle so much, okay? I can have it, and I'm, and I'm fighting this pass here. If it's no gi, maybe I have his wrist, and he won the underhook. So if he won the underhook, I can have his wrist, and I'm gonna post. When I do post, I want to post so much so that I'm trying, even though his head's right, keep your head close to me, I'm trying to be on this side of his head a little bit, okay? It's not going to be perfect, but uh, I would rather not come with my arm on this side of his head, and I'll show you why in a second. So, again, I'm here. I'm trying to get my pass. He's grabbing my hip. I'm going to plant real far back on my foot, and I'm going to pull his arm with me. Watch. So I come back, and I pull his arm across. He starts to come up to his knees, and I hit my switch. Now I'm on his back. I right, show it from a couple different angles. So I'm here, I pull him up, pull this across, I can even stuff it in. Right, I've got my switch on his back. Maybe I've got wrist control. Right, or he won his underhook. Boom, I'm here, post, I got the wrist control. I come over, up on his back. One last time.